space, the final frontier. These are the voyages of the Starship Enterprise. It's five-year mission to explore strange new worlds, to seek out new life, a new civilization, to boldly go where no man has gone before. Hi, and welcome back. So, last time we got the engine bay fitted and we did some of our painting on the underside. So, this time we're going to start on the rear and the front suspension and get the exhaust fitted. Um, I'm going to start, start off, I need to get all these parts cleaned up, all the you can see there, mole lines removed and little bits from where it was connected to the sprue. So we'll get all that cleaned up, sanded down using 600 grit sandpaper. Um, get it all primed up. Um, we get to use these little bits this time. Um, like polyurethane caps that go in to the brake calipers so I'll try time to be doing both front and rear at the same time so I don't lose them when I open the bag so I'll get these cleaned up get them primed and we'll get back to you okay so everything is cleaned down same stone primed them all up left suspension Sorry, rear suspension, front suspension, exhaust parts, other bits of suspend parts for them in the suspension. Um, most of this is going to be in semi gloss black and chrome. Bit of gun metal in there in places, bit of gold in places. I'm just going to go ahead and get it all painted up so we're ready to start putting pieces together and then I'll get back to you. Right, so I'm getting the semi-gloss black down over all the parts. Um, some of it will be staying the semi-gloss black, but other parts will be going metallic. And as I've said previously, always best to put metallics over uh, a black paint. So I'll get this finished and then on to masking. Right, so on with the masking now, using Tamayura tape. Uh, to get the big largest parts done and um, really worth taking the effort to make sure everything you want to protect is covered and um, smaller parts little round parts are finished with humbrol uh, masking fluid all covered and the rest of the parts masked Right, painted everything I just masked, starting with blue. Uh, gold leaf on the calipers and parts of the suspension. I masked off the calipers afterwards and went over the rest of the brake discs with gunmetal. Separately, I um, did the inner of the brake discs with chrome. I'm spraying the rest of the parts with chrome now. And that's everything painted up, ready for assembly. Paint takes longer to mask. Right, I've got all my parts painted now. All the masking tape taken off. So we can see like the chromes, the golds against chromes. Um, I went on this exhaust and I did this part in aluminium and the ends in aluminium so there's a contrast looks good this is the part i was masking earlier you can see the result that all that effort to mask has done so i'm gonna next step is getting uh, the sub assemblies done and then i can start fitting it all into the chassis so i'll get the sub assemblies done and we'll get back to you
Right, I've got the rear suspension sub-assembly done. Um, need to do a little touch-up there with the black semi-gloss and Mr. Part masking. These things happen. Um, I have made a right balls up. I've detailed the wrong side of the brake discs. <laughs> so I need to get these painted up properly on this side. Oh, this side's painted up lovely, but you don't see it. Um, never built a car model before, and I don't drive, so I'm going to put it down to that. Um, but I'm just going to hand paint these into the colours they need to be. I'm not going to try masking it all and airbrushing. Um, for the other side, you can see I've got the same. It's all chrome and all that. Nothing on the other side, and that's the side that's going to be in view. So I need to get them painted as well. So I'll get them painted. Um, the front suspension sub-assembly done. And I'll get back to you. Right, so front suspension is all together as well now. I've redone the brake discs. And I'm a lot happier with them now look a lot better should have read the instructions more the part you can't see is really nice <laughs> so next uh, stage is getting all this fixed into the chassis so I'll get all that attached and we'll have a look right so that's the suspension and exhaust fitted now and um, all went together really really easily I'm really happy with how this is looking um, like I said this is the first time I've done a car model and only build Star Trek models and I'm not used to things going together this easily <laughs> and this detailed for a, very, for a cheap model kit I'm very impressed um, but that's look I'm really happy with how this is looking lots of detail um, but I think I'm going to leave it there for this time uh, next time going to look at weathering the bottom uh, probably get the wheels fitted as well and see where else we get to but for this time thank you for watching keep trekking and keep modelling thank you Bye-bye.